So hey there, it's Gramps here and we are back on Tech Store Simulator. I've been uh, in the Discord quite a bit over the last couple of weeks. One of the things that I wanted to know was how could I save my game data if I want to test other different things as I was going along. And as you can see on the screen, but there's no way to save a game. You can only have one game at a time, but let's say that you've gotten so far into the game and you want to keep a copy and then start new, maybe let Whiskey Willie, like, hey, in this other video here I had before, <laughs> maybe have him go blow up our competitor and then come back to your regular game uh, and keep going. Well, here's a bit of a disclaimer. First off, I haven't successfully done that with Whiskey Willie, so don't take that as a good example. But I have been able to save the game and continue playing and revert back to an older version or start a new game, test something out, and then come back to my previous game. But all to say, that is very risky. This is risky. It's not something that's set up in the game right now. So proceed at your own risk. All right, so with that warning and disclaimer out of the way, I will not be held responsible if you blow up your game. All right, so let's get into it. You will see sometimes I'm gonna turn my head because I'm having dual screens right now. Um, again, another disclaimer, even as I was doing this video, I deleted one of my save games, so I had to revert back to an even older version. So I just wanted to let you guys know that ahead of time. There is risk in doing this. You may destroy or delete something you don't want. But uh, as you can see, uh, here's one of the, the glitches. So this, this uh, competitor here is now no longer blowing up, or maybe it's not a glitch. Maybe I just don't understand it, but... Whiskey Willie is down here, and some time along the way, I lost the ability to talk with him. So, just kind of keep that in mind. All right, but I know that's not what you're here for. You're here for how to save Gramps' Gaming Emporium for t from total destruction. Uh, as you go in here, we can see this is what we got. Look at our money right now we're at 11,026 because i think that's going to be the best way to do it we have uh, this stalker in here and two cashiers and now we're going to just go ahead and go back to our main menu and exit the game so in order to make a backup of this game you actually have to go into your registry when i was in the Discord, a lot of people were questioning, hey, how can I do it? Where are the save files? I finally just messaged the developer directly, and he said he gave me enough information that this is a registry. So if you're on a Windows machine, I'll show you how to do that. All right, so to get to the registry, you just click on your little thing here, and you type in registry, or excuse me, you type in reg edit, and hit enter. There will be a uh, thing that comes on your computer that says, do you want to uh, proceed? So just click yes to that, and you're gonna open up your registry editor. So again, the only thing we wanna do is save. We don't really wanna touch anything else. And we want to go into current users, scroll down, go to software, and then we're looking for Astrosoft, so that's the developers that are creating that. You can see that I have one for Tech Store Simulator and one for when I was playing Tech Store Simulator Prologue. All you do from here is you right click with your mouse and you go to export. And we're gonna put it on our desktop and you'll see it in a minute pop up. We're just gonna call it Tech Store Simulator. You can see I have several that I have done that it memorizes. And we're going to make sure that it's set here. I mean, it sets there by default, but just hit save. We get this little um, thing here says, do you want to replace it? We're going to say yes. And let me switch my screen on OBS real quick and go back to the main screen. We're going to close that out. And now you can see we have Tech Store Simulator dot reg up here and that is our game save that is the 
save from the registry. So we're going to start up Tech Store Simulator. And all I'm going to do right now is I'm going to start a new game so that you guys can see what's going on here. And I'll probably cut out some of this stuff where we're waiting here and zoom in and zoom out. But trust me, I'm, I'm running this with one, one shot. And we're going to hit new game. So this is going to start us brand new, fresh, uh, totally from the beginning. I'm not sure why the loading screen takes so long, but it does. But the main thing is I want to show you start to finish. All right, you can say, see here it says, hey friend, thank you for buying the game. So we're back at the original game screen. We're going to hit uh, escape. You can see we have, let's go get our first uh, computer. Go to the computer and get our first supplier. Our storage is closed. We have no products. We have no employees. There's actually not even the competitor here yet because I don't think they come until day two. And where's Whiskey Willie? Oh, he's over here. And you can see that if we wanted to, he's got the exclamation point above his head so we could talk to him again. All right, let's go ahead and back out. Go back to the main menu. We're gonna quit the game. Then from here, all you have to do is double click your your uh, registry editor here. Again, it's gonna ask you, do you want to proceed? So uh, I don't know if you see this on the screen because it blanks out OBS for me or not. But if you do, you'll see that I hit yes. It's gonna ask you, do you want to confirm? Say yes. And it says the key and values contained, tech store simulator reg have been successfully updated. All right, so now we're gonna open the game back up. And this time, instead of clicking new, we're going to click continue. If everything works right, we'll be back at our original store. Again, it's just these long pauses. I would, I would actually cut here, you know, so you guys could see it, but don't want to do that so you guys can see that I'm not doing anything special. All right, so now we're back in the loading screen. Hopefully this will load up quicker but it shouldn't be that long of a video anyway maybe five minutes six minutes maybe longer i'm not very good at estimate time oh over seven minutes we're almost there we're almost done all right as you can see we are now back to Ga gramps's gaming emporium our competitors back we got our employees and that's it I do believe there are some um, limitations to this. Like I said, this is open, but I can't talk to Whiskey Willie, so that can't be blown up anymore, And which is fine. But one of the things that I want to use this for was to watch blowing it up and then reset back to my game with it out being blown up, and uh, I wasn't able to do that. All right, so anyway, that's how you back up, save, and restore your game in Tech Store Simulator. I hope this is helpful. Let me know down in the comments below. Uh, I'll continue on with some of the videos on the product pricing and updating the spreadsheet, although I'm behind now because I've reset my game back to earlier than my last save. So... Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave your comments, like, subscribe. Until next time, this is Gramps, and we'll see you.